because you get to meet other people who have the same challenges and you know like you're not alone, you're all going through this together. Now, yeah, now I am um, not scared because anymore. Because I know everybody's normal and I'm normal too, so I just have diabetes. Let's just say I forget everything about the diabetes. It makes it all fun. Like you, it's like you're treated like a normal kid. We love it. It's Maddie's favorite part of the entire year. She looks forward to it. She gets to be with other kids just like her. And um, it's been a great growing experience from her for her. You know what I see? I see she can't wait to get back. You know, every year she can't. I'm, I'm trying not to get emotional, but you know, just that your daughter has the opportunity to be with children her age that is dealing with the same thing that she is and that she knows that she's not alone. And for her to look so forward to getting back to that every single year and just um, have children her age that can, can relate to what she's dealing with because she's the only one at her school, you know. And so uh, it's just such a wonderful opportunity. Right here they come. Wow. <laughs> you know, I look at this camp as the fabric of what we do. It's a part of our community. It's something special that we're able to provide. And uh, being the lead community provider, uh, in, not only in Coral Springs, but Broward County, uh, the fact that we're able to do this is an extreme honor and privilege to be a part of. So you always have them do it at the side. The reason why we have Camp Coral Kids, we try to do lots of teachable moments between the parents and the children to prepare them to go to any camp that they would be able to go to. So we have specialized pediatric nurses from Broward Health who monitor the campers' blood glucose readings and make sure that they have proper insulin dosing for their meals and snacks. We have physicians who are also on site. It's really nice to see that checking their blood sugars and giving their insulin is something that everybody around them is having to do rather than them having to be the only one, which is often the case for them when they're at school. Um, so it's been a great experience and diabetes is really just a small part of what happens here. They're really having fun and they forget that they have diabetes and that's the goal of camp. I love coming here. I can't believe they pay me. <laughs> One of the things we do at Camp Coral Kids is to make sure that they're treated just like any other camp, that they have field trips, they have their lunches, they have swimming, whatever a camp does. I like going to the pool, hang out with my friends. So today the animals came and they had a zoologist come and bring all of her assortment of animals and they put on a fun show for the kids, which is it was entertaining and funny and the kids loved seeing all the animals and each animal they described their unique traits and everything and I feel that that uniqueness of the animals really showed the kids that they can totally be unique in their own way and showed off as, you know, because it's cool to be unique. It's really, it's fun and there's lots of things to do, especially color wars. It's my favorite day, color wars. Every year at the end of the camp we do what's called color wars. So we break the cabins up into teams so they get to meet new people and we do a bunch of activities outside, like active, and then we come in for some mind games, some diabetes stuff, um, and then at the end today when the parents come we'll put on shows for them and then um, I announce the winner of Color Wars, which is very serious business. It's second place! The great thing about Camp Coral Kids is that uh, in the process of having fun, we have programs where we educate their, uh, the children uh, to learn how to deal with their uh, uh, condition on a day-to-day -day basis. The kids, I think, are learning, they're learning to be braver. The kids, that's what they're really getting from. I think seeing older kids and even younger kids doing things that maybe they're not comfortable with yet or they're a little scared of, seeing them do that gives them the courage and makes them more willing to do stuff like that, like giving their own shots. My brother gave his own first shot the first year he was here, and it was like nothing. And that's because seeing the older kids and even the counselors, um, seeing them do this stuff with such ease and showing that they're not alone in this, you know, this journey, it, it really helps them. She can do everything by herself a lot because of the camp here, 
They really install a, a sense of um, independence in the kids to be able to function outside on their own. If you're considering camp, come. Um, come to orientation. I know it's scary and I, I feel like that's a huge, uh, there's trepidation for the parents and the families, but there's so much love here. There's medical staff, um, there's counselors that have diabetes that the kids can look up to. So if you are considering it, come. Come see what we're about, see how loving it is, see how safe it is, um, you know, see other families going through the same things that you are. It feels good to know that you're not alone, so come. Send your kid here, it's the best experience for a new kid diagnosed with type 1 diabetes or someone that's had it for a while, that it, they connect with other campers um, with type 1, and that builds a bond so strong, and just to have a fun, carefree two weeks at camp, it's the best experience. Don't look back, sign up, get your spot guaranteed for sure. Yeah!